Have you ever wondered how computers understand your instructions and perform complex tasks? It's like magic, right? Well, not really. Computers, at their core, operate on a simple system of ones and zeros, representing electrical signals on or off. This system is called binary code. Everything you do on a computer, from browsing the internet to playing games, is broken down into these simple binary instructions. Amazingly, these strings of ones and zeros can represent letters, numbers, images, and even the instructions for running complex software. The key to this magic is understanding how computers process and interpret these binary instructions. That's where the CPU, the brain of the computer, comes in. Let's delve deeper into how this fascinating process works. Imagine the CPU as the brain of the computer. It's a tiny chip that's responsible for executing all the instructions that make your computer work. But how does it understand these instructions? This is where binary code comes in. Binary code with its ones and zeros represents the on or off states of electrical signals. The CPU is designed to process these signals at an incredible speed. Each one or zero is called a bit, and a group of eight bits is called a byte. These bytes form the basic building blocks of data and instructions for the CPU. For example, the letter A is represented by the binary code 01000001. The CPU fetches these binary instructions from the computer's memory, decodes them, and executes them one by one. This continuous cycle of fetching, decoding, and executing is what makes your computer function. It's a complex process happening at lightning speed, all thanks to the power of binary code and the CPU. Communicating directly in binary code would be incredibly difficult for humans. Imagine writing an entire program using only ones and zeros. That's where programming languages come in. Programming languages act as translators between humans and computers. They allow us to write instructions in a more human-readable format, using words and symbols that make sense to us. These instructions are then translated into binary code that the CPU can understand and execute. One popular and versatile programming language is Python. Known for its simple syntax and readability, Python allows even beginners to learn the basics of programming and create powerful applications. Let's take a closer look at how Python bridges the gap between human thought and computer execution. Python is like a friendly interpreter between you and the computer. When you write code in Python, you're essentially giving the computer a set of instructions in a language it can understand, albeit indirectly. For example, if you want to display the text, hello world, on the screen, you would write the following code in Python print hello world. This simple line of code demonstrates the elegance of Python. The function is a built-in feature of Python that tells the computer to display whatever is inside the parentheses. In this case, it's the text, hello world, enclosed in quotation marks. Python's straightforward syntax and intuitive commands make it an ideal language for beginners and experienced programmers alike. But how does this human-readable code get translated into something the computer can actually execute? Section 5. From Code to Action. The Role of the Interpreter. The secret to Python's accessibility lies in a crucial component called the interpreter. The interpreter acts as a middleman between your Python code and the computer's CPU. When you run a Python program, the interpreter reads your code line by line. It analyzes each line, checks for any errors, and then translates that line into machine code that the CPU can understand. This process of interpretation happens in real time, allowing for immediate feedback and execution of your code. The interpreter acts as a bridge, enabling humans to interact with computers in a more natural and efficient way. Through the power of the interpreter, Python empowers users to create a wide range of applications, from simple scripts to complex web applications, all without needing to write complex binary code. Section 6. The Dark Side of Code Hacking While programming languages like Python are powerful tools for creation, they can also be exploited for malicious purposes. This is where the concept of hacking comes in. Hacking refers to the act of gaining unauthorized access to computer systems or networks. Hackers exploit vulnerabilities in software or human behavior to gain access to sensitive information or disrupt the normal functioning of systems. Hacking can have severe consequences leading to data breaches, financial losses, and even disruption of critical infrastructure. Understanding the methods and motivations of hackers is crucial for protecting ourselves and our digital assets. 
let's explore some common techniques employed by hackers to infiltrate systems and compromise data. Section 7. Cracking the Code – Common Hacking Techniques Hackers employ a variety of techniques to breach security measures, each with its own level of sophistication. Two common methods include SQL injection and brute force attacks. SQL injection targets websites and applications that use databases. Hackers exploit vulnerabilities in poorly written code to insert malicious SQL commands, tricking the database into revealing sensitive information. Brute force attacks on the other hand rely on sheer computing power. Hackers use automated tools to try thousands or even millions of password combinations until they find the correct one, gaining unauthorized access to accounts. These are just two examples of the many techniques hackers employ. As technology evolves, so do the methods used to exploit vulnerabilities. Staying informed about these techniques is crucial for developing robust security measures. Section 8. Ethical Hackers, the Guardians of the Digital World While the term hacker often carries a negative connotation, there's another side to this community. Ethical Hackers. These individuals use their knowledge of hacking techniques for good, helping organizations identify and fix security flaws before malicious actors can exploit them. Ethical hackers, also known as white hat hackers, play a vital role in making the digital world a safer place. They conduct penetration testing, simulating real-world attacks to identify vulnerabilities and recommend solutions to strengthen security. Their work is crucial in an increasingly interconnected world, where cyber threats are becoming more sophisticated. By proactively identifying and addressing vulnerabilities, ethical hackers help protect individuals, businesses, and even governments from cyber attacks. Section 9. Knowledge is power. Understanding for building and protecting. In this digital age, understanding the fundamentals of computing and programming is no longer a luxury but a necessity. Whether you aspire to be a programmer, a cybersecurity professional, or simply a responsible digital citizen, this knowledge is empowering. For aspiring programmers, understanding how computers work at a fundamental level enables you to write better code, create more efficient algorithms, and develop innovative solutions. It's like having a blueprint of the machine you're trying to control. For cybersecurity enthusiasts, this knowledge is your first line of defense. By understanding hacking techniques, you can better anticipate threats, implement robust security measures, and protect yourself and your data from malicious actors. Section 10. The future is code embrace the digital age. We live in a world increasingly driven by technology. From smartphones to self-driving cars, software is everywhere. Understanding the language of computers, whether it's Python or the underlying binary code, is like having a key to this exciting and ever-evolving digital landscape. Don't be intimidated by the technical jargon or the seemingly complex concepts. Start with the basics, explore online resources, and don't be afraid to experiment. The world of computing is vast and rewarding, offering endless opportunities for learning, creation, and innovation. Embrace the digital age, learn to code, explore the world of cybersecurity, and become an active participant in shaping the future of technology. Section 11, conclusion. From the ones and zeros of binary code to the elegant syntax of Python, the world of computers is a fascinating journey of discovery. By understanding the fundamental principles of how computers work, we unlock a world of possibilities, from creating innovative software to safeguarding our digital lives. As technology continues to advance at an unprecedented pace, our understanding of these concepts becomes even more crucial. Embrace the power of knowledge, explore the endless possibilities of the digital world, and be an active participant in shaping the future of technology.